Good morning, Celebration family, and welcome to day 20 of the 21 days of prayer. Today, our topic is salvation for this generation. We're looking at a scripture in 2 Peter. It's chapter 3, verse 9. The Lord is not slow in keeping his promise, as some understand slowness. Instead, he is patient with you, not wanting anyone to perish, but everyone to come to repentance. Today, we are praying for salvation for our generation. Now, it's God's heart that everyone comes to repentance. His heart is for everyone in this generation. We have the unique gift of being alive right now in this time. Now, some of us are privileged to bring wisdom and experience, and others are bringing new vision and drive for the future. But all of us are right here in this season and this time for God's purpose. We're all called to build the kingdom of God right here and right now. The greatest mission of the church is connecting people with the heart of God. We are the hope of the world. Jesus came to seek and save the lost, and he promised that his followers would do even greater than he did. We are praying for and believing for a revival in this generation. All of us long for heaven. We long for the day that Jesus will come back. And the best way that we can spend our time waiting is by bringing people along with us, by telling them about the good news of Jesus. I want you to pray with me today for our generation. Pray that God would bring revival and that it would start in families, in households. Pray for godly marriages, for couples who decide to stand together for Jesus. Pray for bold, biblical parenting for families that take a stand together to live for God's word and not for the principles of this world. Ask God to raise up bold people who will follow the call of the Holy Spirit, that will take the gospel into every corner of the world, in other countries, but also here at home. Take a moment to pray for your school, your workplace, or your community, wherever you have an influence with people. Name that place. Think about those people. Ask God to send people to proclaim God's truth to them. Ask him to give you and your family the boldness and the courage to be people who invite to church, people who talk about Jesus, people who share their testimony. Ask God that revival would start with you. For a deeper passion for the lost, for a burden for people to come to know Jesus. Ask that God would give you a commitment to love, serve, and win this generation for Christ.